Friday afternoon at college with my best mates, Lizzie and Dev. We were chatting about the party we were going to that evening. So, Sophie, are you going with that guy, Callum? Yeah. Yeah, how's it going with you two? Good? Oh, it's good. We had a great night at the party, but Callum and I left early to go to his place. Before we knew it, we had sex. It was the first time, and the first time unprotected. I didn't know what to do. I was so scared. I'd taken one of those morning after pills, so I couldn't be pregnant. What if I'd caught something? I'd heard STIs were common with young people. What about HIV and AIDS? Over the next week, I didn't do anything. I just panicked. Then I knew I had to do something about it. So I looked on the internet to find out if I could get a private test for STIs. I first did some research. All I kept finding out was how common infections were with young people. Site after site came up, all saying the same thing. Then the same information began to echo in my head, as though someone was whispering it over and over again. I froze, even though my pulse was racing. I closed my eyes and just listened to my heartbeat gradually coming back to its normal pace. I had to act logically. I focused my attention on finding a place to get tested. After a while, I found a special clinic called a gun clinic in my area. I calmed down a bit as it said it would be confidential and I didn't need a booked appointment. At the gum clinic, I first had to register, but was only asked to answer general questions like what my ethnicity was so I could remain anonymous. I then sat down with a doctor and we had a chat. I then had to do a blood, saliva and urine sample, but that was it. The doctor said I would get the results in about 10 days' time. I gave my number so the results could be sent by text. I felt a bit more relieved that I had done the test and was surprised how quick it was. But it wasn't over yet. I still had to wait 10 days, which felt like years. Eventually, I received a text from the clinic. The results. I tested positive for chlamydia. I, I was just numb with fear. I wanted to scream. But then again, the doctors had said it could be treated easily. I was nervous, yet so relieved that I didn't have HIV. After that, I went back to the gum clinic and the doctor gave me some special medicines. She said it would soon go away, but I was lucky that I tested for it early. I now still go to get checked once in a while, just to be on the safe side.